Well, the State Department of Public Health is warning people this morning about an unusually high number of infections caused by a bacteria in the water in Long Island Sound. In July, one person was infected, and now the number is up to five. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Cruz is live from West Haven Beach this morning with what we need to know. Good morning, Carolina. Good morning. Five cases might not sound like a lot, but to put it into perspective, we had seven cases in the last 10 years from 2010 to 2019, and now we've had five cases in just two months. And one of the state's top epidemiologist says that is concerning. He says even though this is a rare disease, it can be deadly and people can get it through cuts or wounds, um, recent piercings and tattoos. The five people who were infected this summer in our state are between the ages of 49 and 85. They're from Fairfield, Middlesex and New Haven counties. All had to be hospitalized. They either had a wound or a cut or they got one while they were boating, swimming or crabbing. In some severe cases, people need intensive care or might need an amputation to stop the infection. The Department of Public Health warned residents along the water in a robocall yesterday. This is an emergency message. DPH warns residents in shoreline areas of illness caused by bacteria in salt or brackish water. I was trying to think if my daughter has any cuts on her or if she was going swimming because it said not to go in. The DPH recommends if you have a cut or if you have a wound, make sure that you cover it completely. Make it waterproof if you're headed to the beach and then make sure that you disinfect thoroughly afterwards. But the best advice is to just avoid getting in the water altogether. Reporting from West Haven, I'm Carolina Cruz, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.